In 2023, District 6900 was awarded a $30,000 collaborative grant to fund the Strong Mind and Body Box Project. This is the first time ever in the history of District 6900 that we've been able to apply for a district grant. You had to have at least three clubs working together on a project. We have eight clubs in our area that are working together on a project. The project is called the Strong Mind and Body Box because we know it's just as important for your mental health to be good as it is physical health. The eight Rotary Clubs decided to create food boxes to help those suffering from food insecurities in their own communities. What we decided to do is to come up with some healthier food items than normally what might be donated to the food bank. So we purchased the items with the grant money. We have healthy recipes, mental health material, coloring books for kids with crayons. We have hotline numbers that someone with a mental health crisis would be able to get in touch with someone very quickly. Luckily, they easily found a community partner to help them with the processing and distribution of the boxes at the Midwest Food Bank. At Midwest Food Bank, uh, we partner with other nonprofits who are serving families and individuals who are going through difficult times and can really benefit from the gift of free food. So every month we are providing those nonprofits with food at zero cost to them, currently giving them about $11,000 in value of food every time they come. When COVID hit, it just, it shifted everything in our community and a lot of our folks that were barely making it all of a sudden aren't making it anymore. I love what we get to do, but when I think about what my family buys when I go to the grocery store, compared to what we're able to offer our people on a Thursday, I know that it doesn't meet all of the needs. So this box takes us a huge leap closer to helping them make, th make it through a whole week with what we're offering them instead of just filling the gaps. One of the really, really neat things I find about the food bank is the number of volunteers that they use every year. Very, very little of what is spent here is spent on salaries, and I love that. Almost every penny they bring in and every food item goes to a family in need. It's just a privilege to be able to partner with those who are on the front line serving the families. I love service. I love being a part of the community and I love giving them back. I'm also a chef, so I feel like being a part of food and being able to give to the underprivileged communities, it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a blessing and an honor to be here. I believe that giving back to the community is much bigger than me. It's much bigger than our club. It's much bigger than the members in our club. That's the whole premise behind Service Above Self, that we look beyond ourselves. We look at what the issues are in our community. Food insecurity is a big issue in our community. And this project, this program, allows us to be able to give back to the community. It allows us to be able to provide a resource, a support for those in the community that are suffering from food insecurity. So what I like about Rotary and the district grants is that money comes right back to your community. When we give money to our foundation, the foundation in turn gives us grant money, which gives us opportunities to serve the people right in our very own communities.